Hello and good morning to all of your sunshiny faces. So I told you guys yesterday that I was headed to the movies. We're going at 11.30 um, and we're going to go see The Age of Adeline. And um, I was just, ow, there's something in my shoe. Uh, I was just uh, working on basically the big changes that are coming to um everything the you know so uh, the the media media art stuff that i'm all changing and everything like that so um yeah that is going to be pretty interesting but i have got to um or i was also uploading the vlogs as well and i gotta find something to eat because i'm a bit hungry this morning hey guys so it's like eight o'clock ish now and we're having dinner it's actually smell like 7 30. um we've got cantaloupe and some breakfast stuff again it's got um crescent rolls on the bottom and then it's like eggs and sausage and cheese in there with a little bit of hash browns you guys can probably see i already cut it up um we're watching the blackhawks game it started like half an hour ago seven o'clock and we, i also got back from the movies and saw the movie which it was really good i really liked it it was a lot like like i thought it was going to be kind of like tuck everlasting um it was a lot like that it was just a lot more like sappy romantic kind of um film it was really nice to go and see that um i liked it so um i'm trying to figure out what to eat i don't know what to eat with an avocado because i told you guys we don't have tortillas and we don't have uh tortilla chips either so i have like really nothing to eat an avocado with and i'm kind of sick and tired of having avocado toast so i've got to come up with something to have with it but um yeah like i said the movie was really good um it was it was it was very interesting it, it actually threw a twist in there which a lot of times like some like romantic movies like that are kind of predictable but it actually threw in that twist in which i didn't really wasn't really thinking about it. like i didn't even know and it was it was pretty good um i really liked it so um yeah i just thought like it was almost like it was felt like it was almost too fast like it was they shoved so much at the beginning like i thought it was going to be more about like finding out that she's like hasn't aged at all and it was more kind of like romantic um which i thought it was it was gonna be that way but more like at the end or whatever but it was kind of like that throughout a little bit and then like you kind of found out like i mean it's called the age of adeline she doesn't age um, so I hope that's not too much of a spoiler, but like I thought that was going to be like more of the storyline, whereas it's more about like, I mean, not really, I guess, but I thought it was going to be more about like her not aging kind of thing and like the sh more, more of the struggles and stuff like that than it was and it was more kind of romantic, I thought, um, but I, again, I really enjoyed it. I go and probably see it again, um, get it on DVD um or rent it or something like that so yeah we're got to find out figure out something to eat so guys i'm having some avocado pockets they've got tomato in there too and i think i might add some cheese what's you gonna make your lip are you gonna make your lip jiggle again when i rub your ear <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Oh, you like it when I scratch your ears? You like it when I scratch your ears? Oh. Hi, Bubby. Look, there's Ike down there. Do you see him? Oh, you do see him. You found him. You found him. He was missing and you found him. Thank you, Blissy. Can I make Blissy kissy? Oh, can you give the people's Blissy kisses? Give the people's Blissy kisses. Oh. <laughs> Blissy, do you like the Blackhawks? Blissy? You say woo woo. Woo woo. Woo woo. Woo woo. You like the Blackhawks? Do you like the Blackhawks? You say woo woo. Woo woo! Woo <laughs> woo! She said Matthew, Matthew! Woo woo! Woo woo! <laughs> woo woo! <laughs> Wissy, let's lift your ear up. Come on, Wissy, keep that ear up. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hey guys, so I'm gonna head to bed. Unfortunately, the Hawks lost. So, um, but it is like 10.15, so I'm gonna just download the vlogs. I almost have them all caught up. I'm uploading Tuesdays right now. So, sorry guys again, they're all behind, but I swear, once this new, um, this new, um, you know, the change, um, what's it called, the, um, you know, all the media stuff, I change it all on YouTube and everything, once that all happens, this should go a lot smoother, and, um, this should be a lot faster and easier to get the vlogs up, it's just, I've been behind since last week, since Thursday, since, um, the, uh, the Brookfield Zoo, which I knew it was going to be a lot of editing and a lot of time um, to edit that vlog because it was so long and, you know, I wanted to include all the stuff and do it up real cutesy and stuff. And so um, I knew that it was going to be like a whole day thing and I was just exhausted after it and like literally my back was hurting so I couldn't sit in my chair. So that's why I was just like, you know, uncomfortable. I couldn't sit that long to do the, the video. And so um, you know, to edit it. So, anyway, that's why they've been behind since two, or Thursday last week, which was actually Wednesday's vlog. Um, but hopefully, again, I, I really just got to stay on track with this stuff. And I'm also, I think I've told you guys this too, but I'm planning on getting a MacBook at some point once I have enough money I've been saving up. Um, but the problem is I... I, I want to get it so that like I can edit my vlogs if I'm sitting on my bed or I can edit my vlogs if I'm you know in the other room if I'm in the living room if I'm in the kitchen or something like that because like I could be watching the Hawks game and then editing you know have edited today's vlog or something or edited yesterday's vlog or you know just gotten back to comments or something like that like it'd be a lot easier because I can't I can do that stuff on my phone but I'm always like I don't know why I just I feel like I need to be on a desktop or you know a laptop in order to actually do that kind of stuff if that makes sense otherwise it's just like on my phone like if I have to real quick answer somebody back I can always do that but if not like if it's normally a YouTube comment it's easier for me to do it and I don't even know sometimes it's weird on replying to YouTube comments on a mobile device as well because it's not set up the same as on a desktop so, anyway, um, like I said, once I get that, which will be hopefully within the next few months, um, once I get that, my life will be a lot easier. <laughs> um, it's just going to be a matter of, like, you know, having it in the other room with me, which is going to be a lot easier. And so, I want a MacBook, but the problem is I'm almost thinking, the thing is, I don't want to give in and just get, like, a cheaper laptop or something like that like a Surface Pro or something because that's what I was I was possibly thinking about getting and I was like even though I know Surface Pros they're pretty decent I I'm an Apple user if if, if they weren't so expensive I'd have it, you know an Apple instead of my desktop computer um or I'd have a, a Mac instead of my desktop computer but I've just I've always had computers growing up but ever since I got my iPod Touch back in like seventh grade or eighth grade or whatever it was I've always like liked apple products and then you know i got my ipad and i my phone and that kind of stuff and i've just i've used them too that's like a thousand plus dollars depending on which one i end up getting uh <laughs> which i could go with a little tiny well not tiny but the smaller screen one for like i think it's like eight or nine hundred still ridiculously expensive and i've kind of decided i'm not going to get a macbook air i'm going to get a macbook pro I think is, I think that's what it is, yeah, MacBook Pro or MacBook, I don't know, just not the Air, I don't want an Air, because even though it's lighter, I feel like the durability, just for, I'm paying extra for it to just be lighter, I don't really care if it's heavy or not, I'm just going to be using it most likely around the house, it's not like I'm commuting with it or something like that, that's why I feel like the Air is more for, um, but, you know, personally, I don't think it would be that big of a deal to me, um, so I'm not going to spend the extra money on that, but I do want like a Pro or, I don't know, I don't even know what I was looking at, whichever one it is. I think it's the MacBook Pros or the Mac, just the regular MacBooks or something like that. And I was like, maybe I could go with an older generation or something like that too, because I know like, I think it's, I want to say Amazon. They sell them new, but they sell them, like they, I think they sell an older generation or something like that. And I know I think on Groupon as well, they had some. 
and I'm a little bit scared buying through Groupon because I've never bought through Groupon before but it would still it's a little bit cheaper than actually going through Apple but again I'm not sure with how the warranties and stuff like that would work even though I think you get a warranty through whatever company you wind up buying it through because I don't think you buy it through Apple I, again I'm not really sure I haven't done all of my research I've done some of my research but it's I just need to like have money so I can get it <laughs> which you know I can't just pull that out of th thin air so once that actually happens too that was the other thing that I was trying to tell you guys about it's just like I need to get more situated with like things so <laughs> once that end up ha ends up happening as well that would be like flawless like I wouldn't be able to I would not be able to have an excuse but it's just like sometimes too like you guys who are you know who do YouTube or who do anything really on the computer, you guys know, like, you can't sit at the computer all day. Like, you have to be outside. You have to be in a different room of the house. You can't be, you know, locked into this one computer all day long. Like, I need to be in the other rooms of the house. I get, like, stir-crazy staying in my room all day long. And, like, sometimes that's what it ends up taking for me to wind up being able to finish, uh, you know, not even just one vlog, but, like, doing, like, a lot of stuff on the computer. Like, replying to comments, uploading a video. Uh, you know editing stuff getting deal matchups ready and stuff like that like it's a lot and especially being in one room all day long it, it's frustrating and it's my bedroom so it's the same place I sleep so I'm literally in the room 24 hours a day <laughs> so it's a little frustrating but um like I said once I get that I can be in a different room I could even be outside and stuff like that and that would be really nice so hopefully I won't have an excuse once I get that <laughs> but I feel like I keep making excuses as to why I haven't you know I've stuff has been behind or whatever and honestly that's why because I'm just I'm frustrated and I get go stir crazy in one room all day long which is why I need my breaks and I need some sports time and that's why I take three hours out, out of my day to go watch uh, this Hawks game and they didn't even wind up winning well I don't know if it was, was it three hours yeah they started at seven o'clock it's ten so Blissy's gonna say goodnight tonight. So she's gonna say, if you guys like the vlog from today, give it a thumbs up. If you guys are new, we'd love it if you subscribe. And we'll talk to you guys all tomorrow. So Blissy, say bye bye. Oh, can you say bye? Blissy, say bye bye. Okay, Blissy says bye. If you like the content in this video, then don't forget to subscribe right here. If you guys want to find more fun videos, check out this channel, this net.